Hello and welcome to Sudoku Pro. Hello everyone, this is Uma Maheshwari solving the five-star Sudoku puzzle from today's in the newspaper dated 11th November 2022. Let's get started. Let's start with this uh, I row. That is this 8, 2 and 3 in this block which blocks these three cells. And now in I row we are only left with Three empty cells. So these three empty cells will take two, three, and eight. That is three and eight blocking from column eight. So I eight takes two. That is eight blocking here from column one. So I one takes three and I nine takes eight. Now the missing numbers in I row are. 1, 5 and 7. There is 1 and 5 blocking from column 4. So I4 takes 7. There is 5 blocking from column 6. So 1 goes here in I6 and I5 takes 5. Now in this 8th block there are only 2 empty cells and the missing numbers are 6 and 9. There is 9 blocking from H row. So H4 takes 6 and g5 takes 9. Um, here in column 6 there are only 4 empty cells and the missing numbers are 2, 7, 8 and 9. Uh, you have 8, 9 and 7 blocking this cell. So e6 takes 2. Uh, you have 8 here in a row and 8 in b row blocking these two cells. So 8 goes here in d6. Now, there are only two empty cells and the missing numbers are 7 and 9. So, 7 and 9 goes in these two cells. Now, in column 4, there are only three empty cells. Uh, this 2 blocks these two cells. So, 2 goes here in A4. And now, here in the missing numbers are 4 and 9. There is 9 blocking from uh, e row. So e4 takes 4 and f4 takes 9. Now we know that uh, there is a 7 9 matching pair here. So in this block there are only two empty cells and the missing numbers are 4 and 8. There is 8 blocking from a row. So a5 takes 4 and c5 takes 8. Um, this there is a 7 here in E row and 7 here in F row blocking these two cells. So 7 goes here in D5 and we have a matching pair 1, 6 here. There is a 3 here in column 1 and a 3 here in column 3 blocking these two columns. Uh, and there is a 3 here in A row blocking here. So C2 takes 3. There is a 9 here in column 3 blocking these two cells. And there is a 9 here in E row blocking this cell. So in column 2, 9 can, 9 can go in A2 here. And we know that there is a matching pair 7, 9 here. So this 9 cancels out the 9 here. So A6 takes 7 and B6 takes 9. Now in A row we have only 2 empty cells and the missing numbers are 1 and 5. So we have a matching pair 1, 5 here. In column 8 there are 4 empty cells and the missing numbers are 1, 4, 5 and 6. Uh, there is 6 and 4 in D row blocking this cell and there is 6 and 4 blocking this cell. Now 6 and 4 goes in these two cells here. We have 6 blocking from 0. So C8 takes 4 and B8 takes 6 and the remaining numbers are 1 and 5. So these two cells take 1, 5 matching pair. We already have a matching pair, 1, 5 matching pair in A row here and we have once again a matching pair here. This puzzle has largely 1, 5 matching pairs. Now in E row there are only 3 empty cells and the missing numbers are 1, 5 and 6. Uh, there is 
six blocking from here. So E1 takes 1, 5. Actually, it is a triplet here. Uh, there is a 5 here. So 1, 6 goes here and 1, 5, 6 may be here. So uh, we already have uh, 1, 5 matching pairs here in column 1. We have a 1, 5 here in A1 and 1, 5 here in E1. Now there are only 5 empty cells. So let's try to fill this column 1 now. Um, you have this 6 in column 2 and 6 in column 3 blocking these two cells and there is a 6 here in H row blocking here. So G1 takes 6. This 9 here in column 3 and this 9 in F row blocks these 3 cells. So 9 goes here in D1. Now there are only 3 empty cells and the missing numbers are 2, 4 and 7. There is 2 and 4 blocking this cell. So H1 takes 7. Now 2 and 4 goes in these two cells. There is 4 blocking from C row. So C1 takes 2 and B1 takes 4. This 3, 7 in column 1 blocks these two cells. So 3, 7 has to be in this section. We have 1, 5 matching pair in this cell. That means 3 and 7 has to go in these two cells. So let's mark it with matching pair 3, 7. Uh, this 4 here in column 9 blocks here. So 4 goes here in H7. Now in this 9th block, there is only 1 empty cell and it naturally takes the matching pair 1, 5. Now in E row, if you say, if you uh, consider this E row now, this 5 blocks here and this cell is also blocked by 5 because 5 goes either here in A9 or H9. So 5 cannot be here. So this cell is blocked for 5. That means in E row, 5 can be only in E1. So let's eliminate 1. E1 takes 5. That means A1 takes 1. This cracks all the 1, 5 pair now. A9 takes 5. H9 takes 1. G8 takes 5. D8 takes 1. Here the missing numbers are 5 and 7. There is 5 blocking from B row. So B3 takes 7 and C3 takes 5. Here the missing numbers are 1 and 2. There is 1 blocking from column 9. So B9 takes 2 and B7 takes 1. Here the missing numbers are 7 and 9. There is 9 blocking from column 7. So C7 takes 7 and C9 takes 9. In D row, the missing numbers are 2 and 5. There is 5 blocking from here. So D3 takes 2 and D8, D7 takes 5. Uh, in E row, the missing numbers are 1 and 6. There is 1 blocking from here. So E9 takes 6 and E5 takes 1. And in this central block, there is only one empty cell and the missing number is 6. Uh, here, the missing numbers are 2 and 3. There is 2 blocking from column 9. So um, F9 takes 3 and F7 takes 2. Uh, so we know that we missed 3 and 7 here. There is 3 here. So G9 takes 7 and G7 takes 3. Uh, here in F row, the missing numbers are 1 and 4. There is 4 blocking from here. So F3 takes 4 and F2 takes 1. Here we missed 2 and 5. There is 2 blocking from H row. So H2 takes 5 and G2 takes 2. Uh, here we miss 1 and 8. There is 8 here. So G3 takes 1 and H3 takes 8. And the puzzle is solved. Hello friends. How did you find the puzzle today? I found the puzzle thoroughly enjoyable. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.